Welcome back to South Africa tonight. Opposition parties are threatening to take action against the EFF ANC run city of Ikuruleni following an outstanding 2023 Auditor General's report on the consolidated financial statements for the Metro. The MMC for Finance says they're yet to receive the report from the Auditor General, which speaks about the Metro's annual financial expenditure, performance, and audit outcomes, but claims the city's finances haven't collapsed. The move leaves the city in the dark about its financial performance and how the money was spent. ENCA's Pulele Chwiti Jones is following developments and, and joins me now. Um, so a real lack of financial clarity is the issue, Pulele. Definitely, and essentially what this does is that the city does not know how it performed uh, annually uh, last year as well. So also there isn't any accountability for where the finances, um, how the finances were used. As much as we know, uh, on the ground there's been um, a lack of service delivery with um, waste ha having not been collected for quite some time. Uh, secondly, external um, service providers hadn't been paid on time. And the city is, of course, not doing well financially. Uh, they have to rely heavily on revenue collection to make sure that they can meet deadline and pay entities such as Rand Water and ESCOM. So essentially what happens is that the city needs to um, submit its consolidated financial statements to the Auditor General. Within three months, the Auditor General then responds um, by sending a draft report, which is a picture of how the city had um, spent its finances and, of course, will give it an audit outcome. But strange enough, the MMC for Finance, Kuleko Dunga, says they haven't received the report from the AG. Many who, have, who I've spoken to here say this is quite strange.